Welcome to another update by Force 13 on the tropics today. Right now, we're looking at the two invests in the Western Pacific, 90W and 91W. Both of them are pretty disorganized at the moment. Uh, not expected to become too much, but some of the models are picking up on them, so we're going to take a look at it. We're going to start off here by looking at Invest 90W just off the coast of the Philippines. It currently has winds of 20 knots with a pressure of 1,006 millibars. Not really moving much at the moment and is still pretty disorganized for the most part. Next off, we're going to look at 91W currently at 20 knots sustained winds and a pressure of 1,007 millibars. As you can see, it's just southwest of Guam and is currently moving west at a pretty nice clip as we speak. The biggest inhibitor to both these invests right now is wind shear. As you can tell based on the satellite imagery and this map here, wind shear is pretty high around both the systems, but it is increasing in some areas and this could lend to some help for both invests. One of the things that is not an inhibitor for both these systems is sea surface temperatures. In the areas of both invests, temperatures are pretty high, well above the normal level you need for a soft clone genesis. So these systems do have ocean temperatures working with them as we speak. Here's what some of the computer models are saying right now. The GFS takes its time with both systems, but a little bit down the run, about five days out, it does develop 90W. Uh, whether or not it's tropical or not is kind of hard to tell based off of what it says, but it does develop it into a tropical storm strength system. Here's what the NavGem says about both systems. It does develop 90W, but not 91W. It does make 90W into a very broad system, though. Intensifies it probably close to typhoon strength, but keeps it as a large and undefined system as a whole. Lastly, this is what the European model is saying. It does try to develop 90W as well, not 91W. Although it's kind of unclear based on this one whether or not 90W does fully develop because it does keep the vorticity very stretched out and not defined to one area in particular. That's going to do it for this update by Force 13 on Invest 90W and 91W. I would like to mention that we do now have a Patreon open at Force 13 on Patreon. The project has run on no external funding for over seven years, but for it to continue to grow and to thrive, we do need help from people in the community. So any donations are very much appreciated. Link will be in the description as well. Check it out. Other than that, you can subscribe to us here on YouTube um, at Fool13 extension 9094 on Discord um, to join the Discord server for Tropical Weather Chat. And Facebook and Twitter are all Force 13, all in text. Make sure to check us out there as well. Thank you for watching.